So we got another part for this Wawanko. Co. We've covered the basic, the bottom of, of the, the actual conga drum pattern. And we have one thing missing, as I mentioned, which is the quinto, which is later on, we're going to get into that, which is the soloist, uh, the, the drum kind of drifts around. So as part of the ensemble, the last supporting, the last member of the supporting cast is a guy that plays two sticks, either on a wood block or on the side of a conga drum or any kind of the, or a wooden surface, and it's really where the cast kind of pattern that we learned on a previous uh, less timbala lesson is the same phrase. Uh, that's really where it comes from. It comes from this guy is playing out in the streets, playing rumba, and it trans that pattern translated later on went to like the timbales. Uh, it's called in this case in the rumba family and rumba language is called the wawa. It's not called the cascara anymore. But it's basically the same figure, if you write it down, musically it's the same figure. But it's played with a certain kind of other, certain other kind of feel. And sticking, it's very important to do the correct sticking on this thing. Let me play it for you. May I also add that this is actually a three-two pattern. You see how this thing works? You start taking every part and you go, okay, is that a 2-3 pattern or a 3-2? It's the same clave. Pa, 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 pa. In the segunda o salidor, it was a 2-3 pattern. So, pa, 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 kin, kin, pa, 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 in. You start on the bar of 2. In this case, this is a 3-2 pattern. So, you start on the bar of 3. If you hear the clave going, kan, 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 kan. Kang, kang. Your downbeat is uh, uh, where you start the pattern or the figure. The figure being cascara or now wawa. Pa, 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 Where's one? One, one, three, two, two, one. Now let me play it for you a little slower and break down the sticking. It's important to do the sticking correct. For you guys that are left-handed, you can actually just see me doing it right here because I'm a lefty. But for you right-handed players, I'll, I'll sing it out to you as a right-hander so you get the right sticking. But let me play it first slowly. If the clavis is going, bang, bang. Pang, pang, pang. So the sticking for a right hander goes right, right, left, 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 right, left, right, left, left, right, right, left, 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 right, left, right, left, left, right, right, left. So you have the right feel when you play this. It's very important the feel when it goes Right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, left, right, left, left, right, left, left, right, left, 